Well, good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Grumman Pilots' YouTube channel, directly supporting the Grumman Pilots Association. And this morning, we're going to talk about the bulkheads on our spinner. This is the forward bulkhead for a Tiger. And what determines the difference between the Tiger and the Cheetah forward bulkhead are the size of the holes. On a Tiger, these are a half an inch. On a Cheetah, they're 7 sixteenths. So, here's a PMA forward bulkhead. What happens with a lot of the bulkheads is over time they get some wearing. Uh, in this particular one here, we actually can feel a crack. There's a crack on the outside which rejects this. Even though at one particular time uh, this bulkhead was aluminum welded very nicely, allowed it to continue in service until the crack on the intersection came in and uh, that completely rejects it. Uh, a few years ago, TCB began making composite carbon fiber. And again, for the Tiger and for the Cheetah. They're a little lighter than the aluminum and they supposedly don't crack. So, as an alternative, if you're tired of replacing the aluminum, well, there you go. You've got a carbon fiber alternative. The problem, that reason that most of these you crack over time is the fact that when you bolt this to the airplane and torque it down you're extruding this aluminum out and it's tightening the hole which will force a crack somewhere else so it's always important that when you take the forward bulkhead and the rear bulkhead off that you do run reams through the holes to make sure they are full size again before you reinstall it Sounds like a lot of issues for the, just the forward bulkhead. There is a rear bulkhead with its own issues, a doubler plate with its issues if you have a Tiger. But we hope you found this useful and informative. Thanks for watching, and have a good day flying your Grumman.